And now, as our heroes in the IDF continue the fight to protect us from Hamas, many soldiers return home wounded and in need of medical treatment. And there's no place better to be cared for than at Shiba Tel Shomer. Shiba goes above and beyond for their patients, including hosting a lunch with Michelin chef Asaf Granit for the wounded soldiers to lift morale and show support. And Ayel Altivi's Ariel Alachiani had the pleasure of attending. Take a look. Hi, I'm here now in Sheba Medical Center, and I'm here with the American friends of Sheba Medical Center who brought around 50 volunteers from across the states and Canada to come to Israel to volunteer. I'm currently in what used to be a geriatric building that has been predominantly converted to a rehab center for wounded soldiers. So we're here today now where a lunch has been hosted for these soldiers by Asaf Granit, one of the top chefs in Israel. We're here talking to soldiers, hearing about their experiences, just to lift their morale, show them support and show our gratitude for all they've done. So let's take a look. We're here with um, friends of Sheba Medical Center. We're from Toronto, Canada, trying to do it what we can. You have Americans coming and supporting and hearing our stories and saying that we support you from far and we love you guys and we appreciate your work. We appreciate you sacrificing your lives for us. It's absolutely amazing. It makes the whole experience and all the rehab and all getting back to life, it makes the experience way different. Everyone here is injured soldiers. And the people that are coming know that, and they come with a lot of energy, uh, donations, uh, projects, art classes, games, food. I mean, it's just, it's incredible what's going on here. The real spirit of Israel, of the Jewish people, of the Hebrew tribe worldwide, you can see that here at Sheba. And of course, the event was made possible in part due to top Israeli chef, Asaf Granit. We're cooking lunch for uh the soldiers and civilians that are hospitalized here. And it's a donation uh, made uh, by the friends of the Sheba Hospital. So my team and uh, my catering, we partnered up to, to cook this lunch and trying to bring a bit of uh, fun and something tasty to nourish the, the soul and the body. Every few minutes, someone is coming to my room and makes me smile. So I'm thankful every day. It's been so inspiring to be here. To see what Sheba is doing in healthcare has been absolutely incredible. One of the leading hospitals in the, in the world. And the research and the innovation, it's such a testament to, I think, the Israeli people as well. And like really coming out and being innovative, changing the game and advancing everything. This event at Sheba Tel Hashomer highlights just one small part of the hospital's tremendous efforts during the war and serves as an inspiration for others to contribute as well. Every small contribution is part of the effort and every small thing, whether it's a, it's a visit, a smile, whether it's money or whatever you can, makes, makes a difference. So people maybe sit at home and they say, yeah, maybe everybody is doing, I'm, it's not needed. Everything is needed. Everything is counted and everything is felt. So I, I can say it on both sides, on, on the part that tries to give and also on the part that receives as a soldier, you can feel every small contribution, so it's very important.